Hey, welcome to Moo Moo Math. Today we're going to learn how to find the volume of a prism. First of all, what is a prism? A prism is a three-dimensional figure with parallel bases. So on this one we have just a rectangular prism because the base is in the shape of a rectangle. It's six by seven, so it's not a square base but a rectangular base. And then we've got a height of nine. So to find the volume, we're just going to take the length times the width times the height. So let's plug in six times seven times nine, and that would always be units cubed because it is three dimensional. Six times seven is 42, and 42 times nine is 378 units cubed. So that's how you find the volume of a prism. So the basic idea is if you have a prism that has a different shape base you're just going to find whatever the area of that base is. So we're just going to say base area, and then you're going to take it times the height. So if you have a triangular base, you're going to use the one-half base times height formula, then times the height of the whole prism to find that volume. And that would be a triangular prism, so I'll just sketch that out for you. So there's a triangular prism. Or if you have like a, a pentagonal prism or a hexagonal prism, you find the area of the hexagon and then multiply it times the height and that's how you find it. Now what's the formula for the area of any regular polygon? It's one half AP. So you can use the one half AP formula for your base area and then just multiply that times the height to find the volume. So I hope this video was helpful in showing you how to find the volume of prisms.